What's up guys, it's Redneck Operator coming at you with another gear review today. Today we're going to be taking a look at the uh, lock and load chest rig from LBX in Ranger Green. Alright guys, I've been wanting to grab this chest rig for a while and finally was able to snag one last week. So here it is. Um, before we start jumping into the features of what this chest rig can hold and uh, all the, the cool stuff it can do, uh, let's just talk a little bit about chest rigs as a whole and what their real application is. Alright, so as you can see, chest rigs do not accommodate uh, body armor plates. And as such, they're not really intended for CQB uh, type situations where there's a high probability of taking rounds. Uh, chest rigs are designed more for uh, reconnaissance or uh, lightweight type stuff where you're going to be doing a lot of hiking, walking, and you don't want that extra uh, weight of body armor on your body. But you still need to carry a combat load. So that's where chest rigs really shine. Um, I love chest rigs. Uh, I've had a D3CR for a year, a year or two now. That's been a great rig, but this rig um, really shines when you need to carry a little bit more of a larger combat load for you know, extended airsoft games or um, you know longer classes and stuff like that. So let's go ahead and dive into um, just all that this chest rig can do and why I like it so much. Alright, to start out with, this is an H-Harness chest rig just like the D3CR. I do love um, H harness when it comes to chest rig. So we'll start off going uh, from the right to the left here. Starting off, we've got the uh, we've got our shoulder straps here. Um, I love that they incorporated this webbing in here to uh, I mean really put whatever you want on there. I liked I routed my uh, radio antenna up through there to keep it from flopping around and such. So that's just a nice little touch. Um, they do have a little bit of padding to them up here in the shoulder. Just to keep it comfortable, you know, when wearing it for a long time. So back here, this is the actual um, panel of the chest rig itself, and it has a Velcro top. So you can see all the way through here is actually one big pocket that you can stick whatever you want in. So just a large amount of storage there. Coming over here, we've got a large pocket here that so you can slide whatever you want in there. I've got a EG18 smoke in there right now, and on top of that. You've got a large um, just GP pouch. So just tons of space right there on the edges, but it's positioned well enough so that it's not getting in the way of your arms. You still have free movement and all that. In front of that, we've got a small um, grenade pouch for a little pea grenade or uh, just whatever you want to throw in there. So then we come over to um, our mag pouches. These mag pouches are all actually uh, double mag pouches, so you can carry eight um, AR mags total on this rig, but you can see even with a single mag, it has very nice retention. Um, so I typically run a couple singles and then a couple doubles as you can see here depending on what I'm doing. So on this uh, left side over here, you have in addition to your AR pouch, you have a double pistol mag pouch right here and you can see that has a nice retention as well as well as the velcro flap and i love how they just kind of incorporated that in there it works great so then obviously here you've got another mag pouch and then you have your zipper now this is a great uh, feature with this chest rig because as opposed to having to slide the straps over your head or um, you know kind of get tangled up in it you can easily just unzip it just like you would like a jacket pull it open, step right out of it. So that's really neat, um, easy for, if you're at a class and you need to pop it off between um, runs and stuff, that's awesome. Nice heavy duty zipper, holds up great. And I love that it zips up instead of down in case you're um, belly crawling or whatever and you know your zipper won't start sliding down in that case. Coming over to this side, again, mag pouch. On this side, you have your um, mag pouch again, and then just a small general purpose pouch for whatever you need here. And then on this side again, 
you're just, um, it's the same thing as your far side. You've got your small grain pouch, a large general purpose pouch with a large pouch behind that, which I have my uh, Baofeng radio in. And then again, to the rear here, you've got that large pouch all the way through this panel. So I wanted to give you guys a little bit of a close up on this setup just so you could really see what's going on here. So like I said, this whole section Velcro's part and this goes all the way up to your center zipper. Tons of space there. You've got this large pouch in back and then your large admin pouch. And then, like I said, you've got your pistol mags with your primary mags. Just a really, I love the way they set it up. Easy to reach. Um, all in all, just an awesome little setup. I just want to give you guys a close up so you could really see what I was talking about. So really, it's just a great setup. There's just so much space, so much capability compared to a lot of chest rigs on the market. Um, like I said, you're getting that um, eight mags, eight primary mags on there. Um, capabilities for, I mean, you could put more pistol mags in here if you wanted. Um, and then just also those general purpose pouches on the side that just give you uh, so much space to work with. That's great for, like I said, extended airsoft games, classes where you're, uh, you know, longer uh, runs, stuff going on like that. So this chest rig really does a great job for that. So yeah, all in all, guys, I would highly recommend this chest rig. I mean, I, I can't emphasize enough how much space this thing really has. I've got a buddy that loves to run really heavy and was really uh, cautious to go to a chest rig because they usually just don't hold very much uh, kit. But uh, he went ahead and picked one of these up and he said, I've never said that, you know, I don't know what I'm going to put in all these pouches before, but he said that with this chest rig. He's super pleased with it. So... I definitely recommend it to anyone looking to get into a chest rig, especially for the price point that it's at. Um, it's really, it's almost impossible to beat in my opinion. So again, I'll leave a, a link to the chest rig in the uh, comments below. If you guys can give me a like and subscribe, that helps me out. Um, yeah, let me know if you've got any more questions about the rig. I'd be happy to try and answer. Till next time, stay safe, guys. All right, so start off, this is an H-harness chest rig. Um, I prefer, I like H-harness. It gives you uh, some nice support um, in the shoulders and just keeps the chest rig up a little higher. It doesn't sag so much. I feel like I'm talking about a bra.